It was only a matter of time before Lionel Messi got his hands on the FIFA Ballon d'Or trophy. The Argentine has been crowned the world's best player for a record fourth time in Zurich, meeting teammate Andres Iniesta and Real Madrid's Cristiano Ronaldo. He scored 91 goals in 2012, itself a record, and his fourth consecutive golden ball is unprecedented. It takes him past the three now UEFA president Michel Platini managed. The truth is that I'm very happy for being able to win this trophy again, for being the fourth one in a row. It's a very big joy. The records simply keep falling for the Argentina international. 2012 brought little in terms of club titles, Barcelona winning just the Copa del Rey after losing out on La Liga to rivals Real. But individually, Messi smashed Gerd Muller's record of 85 goals in a calendar year by scoring 91. To top that, he also holds the records for most goals in a season, most in a La Liga season, as well as notching the most La Liga hat-tricks in a year and overall. Despite his seemingly constant success, though, he wasn't certain of victory. It was a surprise. We didn't know anything until we came here. Until the moment when they revealed the result, the three of us thought we were the winner. That's why it is a surprise. Unsurprisingly, Messi was also honoured with 10 others in FIFA's World Team of the Year. Atletico Madrid striker Radamel Falcao was the only man in that team not to come from Barca or Real. The Colombian has had an outstanding year that culminated in winning the UEFA Europa League and the Super Cup in which he scored a hat-trick against Chelsea. 2012 was really good. It is really important for me because everybody in the FIFA lineup was from Barcelona and Real Madrid. Elsewhere, Vicente Del Bosque picked up the accolade for coach of the year. The Spanish national team boss led his side to Euro 2012 glory, successfully defending the title they won in 2008. It is an honour as a Spanish football representative. Everybody on the stage was from Spain, which was really enjoyable for me. Almost everybody recognised here is from Spanish football, which is a sign of our potential. The night, as it had done the three previous years, belonged to Messi, though, and Del Bosque was among those praising the 25-year-old. Messi deserves the prize because everybody voted for him. But we have to congratulate the rest of the players because they deserved it as well. The Spanish players have won big tournaments like the World Cup and the Euros. American Abby Wambach walked off with FIFA's Women's Player of the Year award. Her five goals for the USA at the London 2012 game saw her beat Brazil's Marta and compatriot Alex Morgan to top.